Hi guys, welcome to my channel. So today's video is going to be a walk through Liberty London, which is a stunning Tudor building in the centre of London. I've been to various times. What I'll do is I'll link in the description bar below and the card in the corner my previous vlogs around Liberty. So this time I thought I'd go through and check out each of the floors because there's multiple floors in the building of all different types of stuff that they sell. So I thought I'd check it out with you. This is the ground floor as you come in from street level. So you've got a mixture of handbags. I think you've got Maria Tash piercings on this level as well, as well as beauty. So this is lower ground floor, this is the menswear section, so you've got a different variety of clothes but pretty much I think all of the menswear is on this floor. And I know from um, who watches my videos, there's a lot of guys that watch my videos, so I thought I'd include the menswear section, seeing as you guys might be interested. So you can see there's quite a variety of different brands. Looks like there's a barber on this level as well. If you wanted to come to Liberty and uh, shop, you can also have your haircut as well. So this is floor one, it's got a mixture of women's wear. So this is the shoe section. If you know, you know. So Liberty have also got a sale on, looks to be up to 60% off, which at the time of filming anyway, looks like there's a few bits left, not a huge amount though.
these look to be reduced to 90, it was 150. This is was 1700. Now it's 1500, but it looks like it's may have got a yeah missing belt. But still looks nice. It's super soft. But yeah, not a huge amount left in the sale though. But um, it's always worth a check. You never know. Also on uh, level one, they have um, looks to be designer vintage, which looks quite cool. <laughs> So this is the second floor of the Liberty Building. It's got the majority of the women's wear clothing um, with all the different kind of niche brands. So these are some little cute kitty Liberty dresses. I don't have children, but if I did, they'd be quite cute to dress up in. Oh, little little kitty dress. That's cute. How much is that? This is Arthur's Cafe. Um, I haven't actually been here before. I might uh, check it out at some point while I'm in the UK. So this is the menu. I think they do afternoon tea as well. So we'll okay, brunch, children's menu, light bites, cakes, salad, tea, sparkling and standard afternoon tea, which is £28.50. And sandwiches, pastries, scones. Looks alright. So it looks quite cool. Maybe check it out at some point. So the brow bar and the um, cafe are all on level two. If you wanted to check them out. And then it looks like they've got pet grooming spa as well and a barber's. Gowns and PJ designs. Wouldn't mind asking the Santa. A nice pair of Liberty PJs. I think they do cotton and silk. I think these are cotton. Very funky. You've got a light kind of funky prints. And then you've got like a shorter set which looks to be £195 and then these are the silk ones so these are just a selection of the PJs these are the cotton ones quite the funky designs not just PJs, you've got kind of dresses So this is the third floor of the Liberty Building 
Now I quite like this floor because there's quite a lot of kind of niche, what I'd say probably quite quirky items and kind of homeware. Now these little kind of mini ornaments are quite, quite fun. And these mugs, I guess they're mugs, animal mugs. Um, you can have squirrels, zebra, tiger. It looks to be £34 for the mugs. Probably not something I would ask Santa for for Christmas, but um, you know, someone's going to like them for sure. And also, you've got various bits of ceramics, bowls, cups, etc. This um, this bowl looks to be about, I think it's about fourteen pounds. Um, nice little bowl. Again, quite quite chunky. And you can also see there's all different mini kind of mugs and other ceramics as well. They seem to like uh, this style in particular. It seems to be quite popular on this floor. And then you've also got a few more other um, jugs and some other little mini cups and saucers. So this is quite cool, Magic Potion. And I'm not sure what price that is. But they've also got, looks to be some other mugs as well. Dreamer, that's £18. And then I quite like these little ones actually. Really petite, look quite fragile actually. I'm not sure how much they are though, but very, very sweet. And I think that was like an espresso. And this looks like more of a sturdy mug. And that I think is about, oh, £49 little bit pricey I think for a mug but yeah you can kind of see all the different varieties of ceramics which is quite fun So this is the bathhouse. I might check out some of their candles actually. £52 for a candle. Really love the boxes actually. So we're still on uh, level three and this is the stationery and book section. If I can remember, I'll put um, details of the 2023 diary that I got from Liberty. Um, I don't think they've got any 2024 diaries out yet actually, but I'll double check. So these are just a mixture of books and cards. So this is what I got um, last year when I was lost in um, Liberty, which is really nice. It's a blank notebook. 
This is floor four, um, which you get a lot of the um, haberdashery and gorgeous prints. I'm actually quite liking this vibe, actually. I love in the green. I don't know if it comes up on the camera that well. And then this is right at the very top of the Liberty Building, and you can see it's not the brightest of days, but it's quite a cool roof. And then, oh, it makes me feel a bit crazy. You can look all the way down, all the way. Now, one thing to note when you get on to level four, which is the top level of Liberty, um, you can see ahead you've got the carpets and rugs. You can't actually film um, in the room with the rugs. So um, I know this because a few years ago I to film and they stopped me so these are just some of the fabrics and then you've got liberty home so you can get furniture cushions all sorts really and as you can see you can kind of get a bed and pillows and then you can get little mini mini ones it's like table linen set of two napkins tablecloths these are quite cute and then you can get various baskets and looks like a dog basket I'm not sure how much that is that's 249 pounds to be per meter so this one is 135 pounds per meter this is 590 pounds oh my god this chair is a total vibe I'm not sure if everyone's vibe but look at that oh my god it's actually huge you can probably fit like two people on there and then you can see some artwork as well funky pieces all very grand I mean that's kind of a large coffee table I guess 
but um, yeah, very funky, very niche and eclectic, which I really love about um, Liberty. You know, you're not going to get this in like the local, the local furniture store, that's for sure. I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.